So why is it so darn cold? Well, first it's winter. We do expect these cold outbreaks, but where did it actually come from and how did it get so cold and so windy? Well, we're calling this one the Siberian Express. If you actually trace back the origins of this air mass, it actually began in Siberia. That's where it's complete darkness this time of year and some of the coldest air on the planet typically is. But if it can get displaced and dislodged by something called the polar vortex, it can travel. And that's what's happening now. The polar vortex actually weakened over the last week or two, and that allowed some of the air to escape the Arctic Circle. And now it is traveling to the south. High pressure has built over Alaska. The winds around the high and between that piece of the polar vortex are now funneling the air southwards over Canada. That first piece that broke off is now located over the Hudson Bay into areas of eastern Canada and that's providing the first cold blast. And what's unusual about this event is that actually two pieces have broken off. The first round is what we've been dealing with. The second round is now coming down through central Canada and this one will be even colder for the Midwest as we go throughout the weekend. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.